And now, your Storm Team 2 forecast with meteorologist Tara Hastings. Well, we're going to see the chance for some showers and thunderstorms developing from the northwest and moving southward tonight. 78 degrees here at 7 o'clock, 75 degrees at 9 o'clock. We'll drop down to 71 at 11 o'clock. Tomorrow morning, we are going to see partly to mostly cloudy skies. The rain will come to an end, 63 degrees. And highs tomorrow right around 72 with partly to mostly cloudy conditions, and we can't rule out an isolated shower that may pop up. Right now, we have that severe thunderstorm watch in effect for Auglaize and Mercer counties, and that runs until 11. 11 o'clock tonight. Here's what we can expect here. We've had a warm and windy holiday with those wind speeds anywhere from 10 to 25 miles per hour. But tonight, our attention turns to the potential for some stronger thunderstorms. So main threat for some of these thunderstorms will be some hail, uh, some gusty winds, and some moderate to heavy rainfall here. Uh, expecting some cooler temperatures to head this way for the rest of the work week. So let's take a look at those temperatures. We're at 84 degrees in Troy, 81 in Greenville. It's 82 in Eaton, and we're sitting at 83 degrees right now in Springboro. Outside right now, our Duncan Oil Company camera located in Springfield. You can see a partly to mostly cloudy sky there, and the trees really blowing in the wind here. We have those wind speeds at about 10 to 20 miles per hour. Here's Live Doppler 2 HD. Right now we are dry, but this is the line of showers and thunderstorms that we are watching here, really beginning to pop up just to the north and west of Indianapolis. This line will continue to move eastward uh, as a cold front begins to progress farther southward here. So ahead of that front, we're warm, we're breezy, but behind the front, we do have some cooler temperatures heading this way. Let's show you your future track forecast model. If you're going to be out and about over the next couple of hours, you're going to be okay here, but about 8 and 9 o'clock, that's when we're going to see the chance for some of those showers and thunderstorms to first enter our northwestern counties around Mercer and Auglaize County. As uh, the line of showers and thunderstorms progresses southward, they're going to weaken a little bit here and should clear the area by about 1, 2 o'clock in the morning. 8 o'clock in the morning on your Tuesday as kids head back to school and you head back to work. We're going to see partly to mostly cloudy skies, a dry start to the day, but can't rule out an isolated shower that may pop up into the afternoon. Going to hang on to the clouds here Tuesday night and also into Wednesday. And Wednesday, we're going to see some more scattered showers popping up into the afternoon. So here's how your forecast breaks down tonight. We're going to see the chance for the showers and thunderstorms here. 62 degrees with mainly cloudy skies and tomorrow up to about 73 degrees, mostly cloudy conditions with a few spotty showers possible. In your Storm Team 2 seven day forecast, some scattered showers on Wednesday and Thursday. Those temperatures, look at that, only in the 60s. As we end out the work week, though, we are going to see nice conditions, partly cloudy skies on Friday with highs near 70 degrees, and it looks like some sunshine for the weekend with temperatures bouncing back up into the 70s. So just stay weather aware as we go throughout the next several hours tonight. I'll continue to track the storm.